おいあの貴様を新宮で処刑するのは何度目だじゃがな一つだけ言っとく今宵の夜はいつもと違うぞ熱量が気持ちが違えんだよもうてめえなんか見てねえんだよ世のメニューはこの TBO だとったミラルそしてこのベルトと世の色に染めるかそれしか考えてねえこれは使命だ貴様には必ず礎になってもらうはいというわけでコメディやってまいりましたニュージャパンワールド認定 TV 王座というわけで相手は噛み砕く噛み砕くとか物騒なこと言ってますけどそれはもう物騒なことはやめて正々堂々正々堂々真剣に戦いましょうKhan is certainly a worldwide star, no doubt about it. And has quite a history with Toriano. Just to tell their history, it could take longer than 15 minutes. Because that's all they've got tonight to determine a winner. Otherwise, we'll go to a coin flip. will advance to take on the winner of tonight's main event, Ren Narita versus Tomohiro Ishii. It's a battle of two great amateur wrestlers and both of their professional styles are unorthodox. First meeting, 2021 New Japan Cup. Great Khan had to cut his own hair to free himself from being counted out. Got revenge in the G1 Climax Tournament. They battled in amateur wrestling contests. Many different tag team settings. And while the great Okan is a worldwide star, Toriano might be the biggest television star in the tournament. The ambassador for Shinichi Chan, an NJPW world star, and has done a whole bunch of stuff on YouTube, and is a household name. He's a DVD producer. And don't forget the Bears and Nabori Betsu. None of us ever forget the Bears. 
Luckily, we get to hear a professional ring announcer with these introductions. ナルビニ、ここ後楽園ホールからここ。スポーツバー、エブリエタスオーナー。ナルビニ、3年ぶりに復活、YTRVTRプロデューサー。ナルビニ、ふるさと納税で so as soon as the bell rings, the time starts to tick. We've already had two matches, have less than five seconds remaining. But we've yet to have one go to time. Yano is the absolute master at winning quickly, so the great Okan is going to slow things down. I'll go ahead and take this time to dispatch with the formalities of the turnbuckle pads. And a double leg dive back to his amateur roots. Oh, trying to sink in the head guard choke and looking for a quick, quick end to this one. Trying to get a pin out of it. So the great Okan playing a little possum. But you can tell he's got that clock ticking in his head. And now Cradle, Yano kicks out, back to the choke. Having Lord Gideon Gray in the corner of the Great Okan could benefit from a time perspective. Provided Lord Gideon Gray does know how to tell time, he may be able to assist the Great Okan if this match does get close to our 15 minute time limit. But it may not go much longer here because Yano is fading. And just as unconsciousness starts to set in, that fear reaction, so common. And so now, Yano rolling to the outside. He's gonna need a little bit of time, get that blood flow back. Moving towards the gray man. And of course, my old partner, Don Callis, used to lovingly refer to Yano as an idiot and a moron and a mental patient. He's actually a college-educated man from the Harvard of Japan. Uh, pulling the uh-oh, wait a minute. Looks like... Yano has found a wayward roll of tape under the ring and deciding to put it to good use. You can win the account out. Well, he's got 15 seconds to find a way out. Now, when they met in the New Japan Cup, oh, look at this pitiful man. He usually has his servants do the tape work, but he was able to get it right. Uh-oh, wait a minute. We might have our first count out. Okan's on his face at 18. The staff of the Young Lions need to do a better job of keeping their tape together. And luckily, Yano was there to find it, retrieve it, and put it back in its rightful place. Uh-oh, baked him out, and now he's using his own hair to choke Yano out. And Marty is 
time he's not going to count the cover made after directly as a result of the blatant rules violation. And the exposed corner, Yano's own handiwork coming back to bite him. Squashed. Oh, throat first on that cable. He could get choked out right here. And Marty Asami finally starting that count. First time call, five minutes in. We're now less than 10 remaining in our time limit. Leg hook, two, and Yano's able to kick out. Both men have been in danger of being beaten. Yano nearly submitted. Great Khan nearly counted out. Plus Yano has been on his back for several near fall predicaments. And now the Great Khan going after the legs. Now going, oh, a scoop and a slam. Cover and almost. He wants him to kiss his boot. The ultimate sign of disrespect. Uh oh, back to the braid. going back to his amateur roots. Watch the exposed steel. Oh, no. Patiently waited. Now the roll up and ring the bell, folks. It's, oh, I thought that was it. Suplex, great awareness of the leg. It gets the near fall. Take down, two. Fireman's carry, floats over, and he, oh, I thought he was going to take it there. Bicycle kick, both men down. What a pace this 15-minute time limit forces you out of your comfort zone. NJPW World Television Title Tournament. First round match between Toriano and the Great Okan. Watch out, Jay! Oh, man! Catapults him into the corner. The spear in the back. And here we go, Yano, almost! Yano's found so many creative ways to win over the years. There is not a moment in time where you can't see Yano do something offensively and believe in your heart of hearts that he's going to win. Spear, nailed him with the spear. But Great Khan can't follow up. Get over, get over, get over, get over. 
Getting very close to the 10-minute call in this 15-minute time limit match. If it goes to time, it'll come down to a coin flip. And now the Monster Rage side of the Great Okan, the Sheep Killer. Backbreaker. Put the squeeze, those hands clasped right across the carotid artery. So now that clock has got to be ticking. You know you got less than five minutes. And when you get an opportunity, wait a minute, the lights have gone out. Who, who has turned the lights out here at Cork and Hall? And what does this mean for the competitors in the ring? What does this mean for our, our, our referee? Or Gideon Gray probably hiding. Oh! Wait a minute. You don't think. Is that who I think it is? I've seen that outfit before. I've seen those taped fingers before. Oh, it's definitely the Great Muda! My God, the Great Muda! The blinding green miss! The roll-up, the roll-up! He's got it! Fortune favors the ball! Yanatoru just benefits! From the unbelievable surprise of the great Muda appearing here at Cork and Hall, spraying the blinding mist into the eyes of the great Okan. some point. 